Hello friends, welcome. I'm going to start a new series about the Alpine.js. It's going to be for beginners and if you want to learn Alpine.js, make sure you subscribe to my channel and let's like this video because it's going to help me to rank on YouTube. Now here we have, I am inside the Alpine.js.dev and if you go and search on Google for Alpine.js, you can navigate to this website which is the official website for documentation. Now, uh, what is Alpine.js? Alpine.js is a JavaScript framework that allows you to enhance the interactivity and functionality of your HTML pages with minimal setup and without the need for complex JavaScript code. It is a lightweight framework with small footprint, about 7 kilobyte when minified, that helps you build reactive user interfaces in an intuitive way. With Alpine.js, you can add behavior to your HTML element using a set of directives that uh, correspond to common use cases such as showing or hiding elements, handing events, managing state, and manipulation of the DOM. And as we can see here, if you have worked with uh, Vue.js, it's kind of Vue.js, but here instead of V, we have X bind. In Vue.js, we have V bind X. HTML, X model, and so on, X4. So that if you have worked with Vue.js, it's easy to understand. Now, these directives are written in HTML attributes, as we can see here, which make it easy to understand and maintain in the code. Alpine.js is designed to work alongside with other JavaScript frameworks or libraries, so you can use it to add interactivity on ex an existing project without having to rewrite everything from scratch. Additionally, it provides a set of utility for common tasks such as uh, fetching data from APIs, working with arrays and objects, and manipulation strings, which can help you write more concise and readable code. If you are using a server-side rendering framework like Laravel, which I work a lot in this uh, channel or Ruby and Rails, Alpine.js can be used to enhance the interactivity of your pages without adding a lot of complexity to your server-side code. If you are just starting to learn JavaScript, Alpine.js can be a good way to practice writing JavaScript code in a real-world context while still keeping the code relatively simple and easy to understand. Now, uh, this Alp the Alpine.js is created by Saleh Porzio, which also has created the Laravel Livewire, which is an amazing tool for building Laravel projects. If you go to the documentation, and let's go there, just I want to show here. Here we have the documentation you can go and read about, which is uh, very easy to understand, I think. Here we have directives, uh, magics, uh, global plugins, advanced, and so on. And also, you can go and watch the. You need to buy here, get access to the Alpine UI components. And here we have you have a pre-made components from the Zalepozio itself. I want to show you is that if you go to the GitHub account to the GitHub repository for this project. And let's zoom it. We can see as the right now Alpine.js has 23.4k stars, which is amazing. Okay, friends, that's it about this intro. I hope you enjoy and don't forget if you like, subscribe to my channel and like this video. And see you in the next one. All the best.